Oh, look at how cool this is. It's in my tent. <laughs> a little bit of ice. <laughs> Two nights on the ice with Gelfo's wind when it's as cold as minus 13 degrees. How much fun can you possibly have with this unique experience? We are in Beijing to enjoy the winter time. It's just cold. Tomorrow morning will be even colder, minus 13. I'm on the frozen lake camping. Hi, good day. Welcome back to Drawing Flow. This is a brand new series in the cold North China. It has been three years we haven't done anything in the Chinese mainland. But this time I have a chance to be in Beijing and the surrounding area to cover some ice and snow activities. Come with me. Beijing is well known for its rich history and culture. For this series, Zhuang Feng sent our best presenter in the team to show you the other side of the capital in the winter time. We camp on ice, hike a long stream, ski next to the ancient palace, walk in a gorge, and ski on hallowed ground, home to the Winter Olympic Games. Follow us on this new adventure to find out what you can do in Beijing in winter. In this episode, I fly from Hong Kong to Beijing and I take a car from the capital airport to Dobo Camp. Located in Huairo district, the camp is about 6 km from the airport and can also be reached by bus, but we suggest renting a car or taxi to get there. It provides all kinds of activities for all seasons. We join the 6th Ice Lake Camping Festival to have the full experience on the frozen lake. But the campsite is open throughout the year with ice camping in the winter. Check the description below for more details. The first night, I take it easy and stayed in the tent provided by the camp, which was already pitched and fully equipped with necessities. It even comes with power supply. Well, uh, I'm back to my tent. I went out to see the night view. It's quite nice uh, on the lake, the frozen lake actually. It's cold. Uh, you can see I'm wearing uh, so many layers. Um, tomorrow morning, uh, by the six or seven o'clock, it will be minus 13 degree. My God, how am I gonna pass this? Tonight, the the little heater stopped working, so the temperature in the tent really dropped. I woke up a couple of times, but luckily, the eating uh, blanket is working. It's a saver. Oof. But I slept well. I guess I was tired. Um, and I survived the night. So cold! Need to have an extra layer compared to yesterday, so... Oof. Oof. This is amazing, yeah? I was about to uh, make some uh, water, hot water, and I noticed the bottle. <laughs> the bottle of water is actually frozen. <laughs> <laughs> what a night! Well, breakfast time. Easy meal. Porridge with Satana's expedition food, as usual. Time to get out to wander around. Alright, I'll give you an idea of how strong the wind was last night. This is a 
hand and pose a completely twisty like this. Uh, they have to evacuate last night. Horrible. Really, really strong way. I joined the annual camping festival where there are many activities put on for the participants. I drone phone, we never say no to adventure. <laughs> If frisbee is not your cup of tea, what about SUP? This is a new way uh, to play with the SUP on the ice. <laughs> So many activities out there, but I have a very important task. Last night, I was in a luxury tent with heaters. Tonight, I want to try real ice camping, so I asked the Moselle Crane Tent to lend me a simple tent for the night. Mr. Xia, the owner was kind enough not only to lend it to me, but help me to pitch it. Yeah, it's almost done, almost done. I then moved in to my new home. New home. Time to relax. So the good part of uh, this kind of camping festival is you meet different people making friends. And here, that's what I got. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Well, this is my setup for tonight. I have this kind of army bed, as you can see. I have uh, uh, insulation mat and uh, my sleeping bag. Uh, now it's about minus 13. So hopefully, hopefully I can make it. And uh, no heating tonight. I'm a heater myself. Tonight, oh, so cold from uh, five, six o'clock until now. I struggle a little bit, but uh, now it's much better. I guess the sun is out. It's kind of uh, warmer, but I made it. <laughs> this is a camping on the ice episode. So um, so far. I experienced both kind of glamping and the real camping can be on the ice experience as you can see. So um, if you like our show, please like and subscribe to this channel wherever you watch it. And also check out our website on www.drumfun.com. My name is Jack. Bye bye.